Look at this. This is, uh, I don't know what to say, Wayne, because I've been coming to Vegas for a very long time and I've always wanted to see your house because it's, I mean, I'm here. I don't know, I'm speechless. This is, well, this is, I don't know where to look. I, I couldn't be more thrilled than to have you here. I'm inside of Wayne Newton's house. This is pretty cool. <laughs> Newton's Shenandoah Ranch might be called the Smithsonian of Sin City. It includes around 12,000 square feet of memorabilia, paintings by Margaret Keane and Renoir, a small zoo filled with exotic birds, even penguins and a monkey named Boo, who I met on, what else? Wayne's private jet. Boo is remarkably attached to Wayne. Moving on, I got to check out his 165 seat theater. Huge screen, what's happening? What's happening is it's the uh, fulfillment of a lifelong dream. That dream includes a sprawling ranch, home to 60 horses. Well, you can have my ear. What is the worth of this particular Arabian? I have been offered over $800,000 for him, and I turned it down. Vegas is perfect for the Arabian breed. And look at this. They train in a horse swimming pool. One time around this pool would be equivalent to five miles at a hand gallop on the track. Wow, one time. With no stress at all on their legs. And you always go back to your animals to kind of keep you at peace. Yes. And on a straight and narrow. Yes. Because you never hear anything bad about you, man. You just haven't talked to the right people. No, but... <laughs> so this is the oh, Red Room. Ooh, the Red Room. I heard about this. You can tour Wayne's World. It's not open to the public. And it's so cool, you'll be able to be in his office called the Red Room. Beneath its ceiling of Carpathian Elm, Wayne's hosted several presidents, Michael Jackson, Frank Sinatra, and Dean Martin. We have everything in here from presidential letters to Robert E. Lee's sword. I don't know where to look first. There's so much memorabilia. You could actually wow. take a week and never see everything in this room. Are you on the Wheaties box? That's me on the Wheaties box. <laughs> you better not spread that around. You're turning your house into a museum for the world to see. My wife said to me one day, did you ever think about maybe opening this up to the public? And it hit me kind of like a ton of brick is the happiest that I am in my life is sharing. And so why not share one of the things that you love the most?